had some people worried about Trump winning, and uh, we're not talking about Trump directly this time, but the stock market. It took a huge drop during last night's election results. Local News 8 reporter Taja Davis talked to a couple of local financial experts today and asked them what happened. Taja? Well, Carol, futures for the Dow last night predicted that the market wouldn't have a great day today based on Trump being the nation's president-elect. But this morning, the markets opened up, and they are doing fine. One financial expert, expert I talked to predicted this was going to happen to the market if Trump did win. And the other is making sure her clients aren't making big moves on what she called an emotional reaction to something that really doesn't have that big of a lasting effect on the market. Everybody had predicted Hillary. It was kind of a return to the status quo. And then with Trump, a lot of things were kind of up in the air. I use the analogy of like a bull in a china shop. Nobody really quite knew exactly how the market would take it. It was just kind of a strange roller coaster, I guess, with just people's expectations and the emotion driving the market one way or the other. As of now, the Dow, the Dow has had a nice comeback from its big fall of more than 800 points last night. In the studio, I'm Taja Davis. All right, thank you, Taja. At 6 o'clock tonight, uh, Taja will be talking more on what the financial experts suggest people should do in the midst of the market's movements. And we'll go ahead and look at how the rest of the stock market closed for the day. Let's bring that up right now. Uh, it was at 2.50 uh, at noon, so it increased just a little bit more after the noon hour to 2.56, but the Dow closing at 18.